I was cleaning the closet the other day when I found this. It is an old portable speaker that I got about 6 years ago. It runs on AAA non-rechargeable batteries and it doesn't have Bluetooth. Instead, it has this analog audio jack to connect to things like phones and laptops. Now, this speaker still works, but I don't use it anymore, so I decided to take it apart and to show you what's inside. I first took out the batteries and removed these four screws at the bottom. Then I removed the grills and the thin pieces of fabric that were protecting the speakers. There was one speaker on both sides, but they were much smaller than I expected. I continued by removing every screw that I could see, but the thing wasn't coming apart. I tried prying off the top piece, which revealed two more screws, but still I couldn't get inside. After half an hour of struggling, I simply cut off the bottom with a hacksaw. Finally, I could open up the speaker and see its components. The main circuit board was soldered to one of the speakers, so I had to desolder them apart. Now let me show you what the circuit board looks like from up close. There is actually not much going on here. The only component of interest is this tiny chip, which is the amplifier. It takes the weak input signal and amplifies it, so that it is strong enough to move the speakers. This particular chip is made by Texas Instruments and can deliver roughly 2 watts of power at the output. One interesting detail is that the chip is a mono amplifier. The two speakers are connected to it in parallel and produce the exact same signal. One more thing I noticed, the speaker was made back in 2007, almost 10 years ago. So obviously this speaker isn't coming back together, but I'm thinking of saving the speakers and the amplifier board. Perhaps I can use them in a future project.